Hi. Hi. It's Chris Day. We're back. And we are going on Tino Iona. Ta da! It's like our third time trying to get on the ship. Oh, third, third time lucky. Yeah, finally getting on. We are buzzing. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to episode 1 of our p and Iona Portugal and Spain cruise series. Case is ready, haven't we? We haven't packed lightly. <laughs> no, we have quite a lot of stuff. But yeah, now we're going to go on our cruise. We embarked Iona at Ocean Terminal. After dropping off our cases, we proceeded through all the usual health screenings, check in, and security. This all took around an hour or so to complete, which we thought was pretty quick. This is the best bit, isn't it? Yeah. When you're walking up the gangway to get on your ship, which is just there. Like, that's like my favourite part ever. And the ship is absolutely massive, isn't it's it? Huge. See, it's enormous. Look at the size of it. Oh well, we're going to see what it's like on board now, aren't we? Must be zigzag. Must be zigzag. We've done a lot of zigzagging today, haven't we? But yeah. it's been so much fun. It's good. Happy days. Well, this looks nice, doesn't it, girl? So we just got on board and we just had a quick look at the Grand Atrium nice. and now we're going to our master station which is, what master station is that? H. Yes, that's where we're heading now. The ship is enormous, but oh my god, there's a studio and there's the nail it. What's that? Anderson Library. Oh, so that was quite easy, wasn't it? The man just like scanned our thing for H and now we have to go to our room. Watch a TV show. Watch the TV drill and yeah, I'm a bit distracted by and the then, baubles. And, yeah, and then we need to find a bar. We were allocated a cabin on deck 11 as we'd opted for a guaranteed cabin rather than booking a select fare. This is far more cost effective if you're not bothered about where your cabin is located. And on this occasion, we were pretty chuffed with our assigned room. I can see our room and our bags okay. and our thing. We'll have to move them out of the way first before we can even get in. This is where our cards are now. Definitely put them in there. And now we go in here. Can I just touch it? Yeah. Oh, that's neat. Mm. Oh, wow. Look at that. Can we just put this in here? We'll have some lights. Put it at this. Oh. Well, this is nice. Actually, it's not that narrow, is it? It looks narrower, like on videos. It's amazing. Take that off now as well. <laughs> Look at this. Have a nice bed. It's very nice, isn't it? Wow, this is really deep balcony, to be fair. Yeah. I've seen a balcony like this deep since like Queen Mary. That is, uh, and our suite. And our suite. Yeah, on the princess. That is nice. This this is decent lovely. size, that. Wow, we have a nice view as well. Yeah. Nice sunny south out at the moment. This is neat. I like it a lot. So we have like bed, and we have the TV, we have the fridge, it's neat. Very it's nice. It's like really cosy, it's really big. I yeah. mean, to be fair, like, it's safe. A lot like, of people say there's not much storage, but it looks alright to that's me. That's quite good. That's like, there's loads of room in there. Yeah. That's way more than like Virtuosa. And, to be fair, like this is a, like a mini suite. When you think of the size yeah. of it, like when we were, when, yeah, the only thing that we're probably missing is a bath, because I think we've got a bath in our room, haven't we? Oh, toilet's quite posh. That looks pretty, like, luxurious, do you think? That's yeah. very luxurious. It's very modern. There we go. That's lovely. Look at the mirror and all. It's like, got like a nice 
Yeah. Shower looks quite big too. Right, got the nifty little retractable washing out of it. But yeah, this is our room. It's lovely, isn't it? Do you like it? I like the colours of that. It's really nice. Yeah. And the artwork's quite cool. No, it's really nice. It's I really like, like that. It's like lovely. This sofa. It's obviously a bed as well, isn't it? I'm guessing. Yeah, it does. I, I saw on the thing on the map, on the deck pile, it said yeah, that it can be. Really nice. That's lovely. Yeah, and it's like really that. plush. Oh, it's a bang in. Bang in. Love it. <laughs> We have to say, this is a beautiful cabin, tastefully decorated, modern and spacious. We're really impressed with it. The man has just been, um, I can't remember what his name was. Noel, I think. Noel, our room steward has been, and he has kindly brought us some wine glasses, because we have some red wine, and we do have some Prosecco as well for sail away. And he's told us about the safety thing on the back of the door yeah. and to watch the drill, because we came on board and we went straight to Muster. Yeah, we did we were Muster away. Station H, which is like one of the restaurants. It's the restaurants. Opal or yeah. the other one. So yeah, we've done that, and now we're going to unpack. And we feel it's very important to mention that our whole itinerary on our cruise mm -hmm. has changed for the better. We are so chuffed with it, it's awesome. <laughs> so basically, we were supposed to do like a Northern Europe's cruise, which was going to go to Rotterdam, Rotterdam um, Belgium, Belgium and La Havre. Um, and that has completely been scrapped because the weather's bad. But you know. We're not complaining. Uh, we're not complaining. It's, well, we, 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 were we, so would, chuffed. we would have complained if we were there, in it, but we're <laughs> not because now we are going to Vigo? Lisbon. Vigo and La Coruna. I mean, I know we've been to La Coruna before and we have been to Lisbon, but Lisbon was a long time ago and we've yeah. really enjoyed it. Vigo's new and More La is nice. It's supposed to be sunny as well. Yeah, it's supposed to get some nice weather, hopefully. So hopefully we're going to miss this rubbish weather and we're going to have fun time. Fun times. Fun times. So people, we just thought we'd show you these. We have a complimentary drink each, don't we, because of yep. our loyalty status. I don't know what lo level we are at the moment. Do you know what level we are at the moment? I don't know, no. So let's let the unpacking commence. So as you can see, we have come prepared with our treats and snacks. Yes. So we have they're, gin. They're not actually our treats for us. They're for our friend who's on yeah. board. So yeah. So they they stay out the way. Otherwise, we might eat them because yeah, they're, they're, they're very good. tasty. If you've never tried a Welsh cake before, you I feel sorry for you. You don't know what you're missing. They are lovely. Mm -mm. So for us, what have we got? Gin. Yeah, that's your that's, gin, Tanqueray. That's your gin. Uh, that's gin. yours. That's your gin. That's mine. Um, and those. We've got lots of thief tree tonic. Tonic water to complement our and gins. And most importantly, yeah. as we learnt from Regal, you need your shot measure so you yeah. have the right amount of gin each time. Yeah, because what happened really on Regal was we were free pouring it at the end, weren't we? And then that's how. Um, you got really drunk, didn't you? You were hammered. I got really drunk today. You were smashed today. You, you were perfect. That was amazing. I was just being charismatic and excitable because I just got on a cruise. Failed. Yeah. That was for like Rotterdam and that side of it. This is for Lisbon. And just you know, we had a we had a last minute, didn't we? Repack yeah. because everything changed. We only found out like a day before, didn't we? Yeah, the day before we travelled down, but two days before the cruise. Yeah. Oh, by the way, there's no drawers in the room, people. But it's not really a problem because, like, I can stick these like in my pants and socks. I'll just shove them. There's a cubby thing down the side of the bed, so I'll shove mine in there. Do you have fun? I'll just go. I'll leave them in the bag. See, they fit fine in the bag. That's all done. And now, have a look at what we have here, shall we? So these are my packing cubes. <laughs> Luke's packing cubes. Yeah. Having, gin's open. Yeah, we've opened the gin, we've unpacked, we've unpacked all of our things, and we also watched our mustard drill. That's all finished, we've done yep. that. So, we're just going to celebrate the beginning of our cruise. Cheers! Cheers. Woo. And then we are going to do. It's gotta happen, it's gotta it's happen. Voila! Life jacket selfie! Shelf. Yeah, it's awesome. Awesome. <laughs> I don't think they want you to have a shelf to put a gin and tonic on when you get on lifeboat. <laughs> but it would be pretty good. They provided straws. 
I mean, they've got disco lights in the front, so that's quite fun. So yeah, cheers, Gavin. Cheers. Happy cruise time. P and Iona. Wee. <laughs> Look, we are about to leave Southampton shortly. It's what time is it now? Half past five. And Gavin's got banana fingers hands there, but I don't know if we're going to be out in time to wave to the people. So we'll wave to you Prob people. Probably not tonight, but we'll wave, wave. wave to these people instead. They're more fun. Hi. They, they comment on our videos, so we know they like us. You just fell over the, the table. Um, and now, look, we're at Southampton, and there's like a white link ferry over there, and a truck carrier car thing. And there's another one, there's another two over there, and there's Galas Gavin. And yeah, we are in Ocean Terminal, we're about to set sail and we're the wrong way round. So he's going to have to reverse out, which I don't think they like actually doing. I think they're scared to drive. Yeah, I think it's like a new car. They're scared to drive where it's busy, aren't they? <laughs> so they're waiting for it to get dark and then, then we will leave. Uh, maybe. <laughs> when, when there's less traffic. When, when there's no traffic, it's like, yeah, when you get a new car, it's like, I'm not going to Tesco's when these people will go at night when it's lovely, which I think is what they're doing now. <laughs> They're waiting, they're waiting for it to be quiet. Let's go on a little adventure to explore this ship because it is enormous. This ship is so big, isn't it, Gav? Mm -hmm. It's enormous. I mean, we thought our room was big, but the ship's even bigger, <laughs> obviously, <laughs> because our room's inside the ship, but let's go have fun time. Well, I've got a map. You've got a map. Very handy to have a map. Is it really? Hey, hey, go this way. Carry on forward. We can go up. Should we have a look, explore? We're just going to probably go up to the pool deck and then walk along because that'll be fun because we can take the people with us and they can see the pool, can't they? The pool? We'll all see the pool because I've never even seen the pool. It's new. Everything's brown, spanky new. Oh, look at this big ball. Who doesn't like a big ball, eh? Wow, this is kind of impressive. That's very nice. So there's like a big bar thing there, and Gavin's going this way, and they're getting the stage ready for tonight. And now we're going to ignite. Is that the show tonight? Yeah. Wow. What's this way then? Do we know? It's really weird because it's like we're familiar with PO, but there's loads of new things and new concepts on board. So I kind of feel like I'm on a new cruise line. So now we're up here by the beach cover pool. Well, they have palm trees over here. This looks totally tropical. I'm picking up nice. tropical vibes. Well, this is the pool with like the wooden seats and the rings. Yes. It's quite nice, isn't it? Wow. It's nice. That's actually quite a nice touch. Yeah, no, I didn't read. Yeah, because they're, they're actually sunk into the pool. I don't know if people can see that. Like, this is always like I always thought they were a bit underwhelming, but yeah, no, they actually sit like in the they're pool. They're a lot nicer in person than they are when you when you yeah. see them. Yeah, do you know I think would be better though if they had like bubbles in there and you put your feet in them Hot and it, yeah, and you sat in them. Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> honestly, like a pet, like a like a foot spa. That would be really cool. So where are we going? And there's a bar there as well. Let's go a bit. So it's a wonder we haven't gone there, but we're, we're looking for the crow's nest. I think what we've mistake we've made is, you know, when we were at the stairs before, we should have carried on that corridor. What deck is, is the crow's nest on? We're on deck 18. Yeah, it's at the front, by the way. So the crow's nest is there. What deck's that? 17. 18. Crow's nest. No, it's 17. 17. So 17. So we're down one. That's what I thought. So we have to actually go. Well, never mind. At least we got to see this. This is lovely. This is really nice. So we made a huge, huge, huge mistake. What we needed to do to get the drinks package go to Ripples because Gavin just asked the man who's over there by the beach comes through. Is it beach coming? Yeah. The trop I'm going to call this the trop It looks amazing. I love the trees. It's nice. lovely. And we're underneath a mushroom, by the way. There's another mushroom over there as well. There's loads of mushrooms. I don't think they're mushrooms. <laughs> well, they look, let's keep going. they look totally organic. Yeah, so we'll go to Crow's Nest. We'll use our voucher for sail away because of our loyalty thing. And then we'll go down to Ripples on deck eight and we'll buy our drinks package. That sounds, that sounds like fun. And we finally found this place. So now we've come here and we've redeemed our voucher for our loyalty. 
thing, haven't we? Just well, go up. It's, it's a long way from deck 18 to 8. So then so we'll get the elevator all the way down to deck 8 to Ripples. But I don't any ice cream. I'm just going to go in and just get my milk drink to Because if I have ice cream, I won't get drunk anymore. Because I can't get drunk on ice cream. Well, no, you just have Pepsi, don't you? That's even worse. <laughs> so yeah, we're just getting our drink now. So we have just been to the crow's nest. It's been amazing in here. We love it, like the ambience and oh, it is just like it's like on Britannia, isn't it? But it's it's really nice. Oh, wow, Keel and Cow. Now I want to come here. This is new for PO, isn't it? So we'll have to try this. Oh, this is nice. Hi. Gavin's buying the drinks package now at Ripples. Oh, no, I'm still lost. <laughs> are you still lost? It's apparently going to be very stormy, isn't it? That's what Captain Camby said. It's going to be very stormy. So I think we need a drink. Now it's time to get them. We've just bought our so drinks package. Let's so just test it. We need to test it now. Let's go this, this way. Let's go back into the atrium or the grand atrium. Look at this is so nice, isn't it? It's lovely. Wow. It's actually quite nice. Do you like it? Yeah. I do. It's lovely, isn't it? So where's the... Right, that's the glass. Oh, should we try our get a glass of wine? Yeah, let's glass glass. Let's, let's go down, down the grand stairs. Over there, the grand oh, stairs. Right. Let's go. So... We are now sat at the glass house and we're in the lovely Grand Atrium as you can see behind me, the beautiful flowers and we're doing a spot of people watching and Gavin's sat over there and we have just ordered our first drinks on our drinks package we have gone for a boom boom haven't we from glass house which is like the bars over there so yeah, we're going to try that now and then what are we going to do after that? That can change you know. Oh is it? Sure, get off my hoodies I, quite, I feel really comfortable in these. I'm kind of enjoying wearing my... I've got my nice hoodie now, it's new. Because I knew this was originally going to be quite cold, isn't it? Because we were supposed to go to, like, like Hamburg and Rotterdam and, like, Amsterdam and wherever. I bought Woolly Hat and all. But he did say it's going to be very rough. Have you been there? We've been to it, thank you. Yeah, he, he said it's going to be very rough tonight and they're going to close the open decks and then Camby, Captain Camby. So, yeah, let's wait for our drinks. Here we go. Oh, thank you so much. That's, great, That's lovely, thank you. Hooray, look at that. There go. It's like... We like Boom Boom, don't we? That's um, Charles Smith, isn't it? Quality wine, that. Uh, I do love Charles Smith wines. They are immense. That is good. That is good, isn't it? They're not small, that's just to be fair. I love, I love Charles Smith. Wow. Oh, that is really nice. Join? Mm, that is intense. And I'm sat here, enjoying the scenery. And the lovely stairs. Do you like it? Yeah. I'm just thinking we can get 15 of these, no? 15. We'll test the package anyway. Do you know what? This, this place is, it is amazing, isn't it? We are loving it. We are like. Glass house, like I thought this place, when you look at videos on YouTube, it looks like really open and like really massive and really sparse and like like you're in an airport lounge. It's actually quite like cozy. It's got, it's got a lot more atmosphere. This, yeah, it, that's the way. There's loads more atmosphere here than yeah than it actually seems on videos. This is lovely. It's like loads of it. Like literally, we just feel overwhelmed by how much is on board. Does have one point she doesn't like? What's that? Yeah. I have to spe I have to I have to mention this, right? This is something I've noticed, right? Oriana has been sold 
and I really feel as though here Tiffany glass ceiling would have looked amazing there. I really think that would have been a perfect tribute to the history of piano, and I think it would have looked absolutely incredible. Do you, do you, you agree? I think a Tiffany glass ceiling from Oriana would have looked amazing up there. That is just like it just changes. Does it even change colour? I don't know. Like, we'll not being funny, but even like Britannia has a star base coming down. Like, like they can, that is a bit. That's a bit lame. That's that is a bit disappointing. Do you, do you agree? Well, that's the only thing you find. So that's far. the only thing I don't like so far. Like, and the ship is enormous. Like enormous. Like, absolutely enormous. So this is now our second glass of Boom Boom Syrah from Charles Smith from the glass house which you absolutely love by the way and there's a man downstairs and he's doing like magic like he's kissing and nobody's nobody's letting him show his magic tricks are they see they say do you want to do some magic it's here's your turn and then they go and i feel really sad because it's sad isn't it do you think it's sad so should we should we do some magic so I, I think we should go and see Should we um, put a mask on? We have to put a mask yeah. on. And then we will ask the man. And then we'll head back to the room. Up, but, yeah, and we will get changed. We're not going to try it's going to be asked. So we're just going to put a sheet on, aren't we? And then we're going to go back out and we're going to have fun time. Because it's like our first night on board. We're going to have loads of fun. Oh, yeah. Let, right, Gavin's, Gavin might have to take over my phone. What oh, are it's going to be wobbly. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. We'll, we'll bring the wine as well. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, so my name is Calvin. I am a close-up magician and tonight Luke, I'm going to show you one of the oldest tricks in magic. It's called the cut and the ball trick. Have you seen it before? Maybe. Maybe. What we do is, can you examine that for me? Make sure it's a normal cup and normal ball. Yeah, you can yeah, take yeah, it. No, no, I can see it. Can there you go. Have a look at this. Make sure it's normal. Nothing weird or strange about either of them. Safe. Happy with that? Yeah, that's heavy. It's a heavy cup. Is it? In case any grannies come after me, I can just... That's what it is. <laughs> so you've got to be prepared on these cruises. <laughs> so this is what's going to happen, okay? All the way through this loop, I am going to cheat. All you've got to do is watch. I'm going to take the ball, I'm going to throw it up in the air, I'm going to place it into my pocket. When you're not looking, back inside that pocket, take the ball, show my hands empty, lift up the cup, and get the ball underneath without you seeing. If you're ready, say yes. Yeah? So I'm going to cheat. <laughs> Hello people! We have come back to our room, finally. Like, the ship has set sail. Banana Finger's hand has missed the boat. No, that didn't, that didn't happen. That didn't happen. <laughs> he, he might do, he make make an appearance like at Everport. At Lisbon, Vigo. So anyway, we, we were dressed in our like, nice clothes. I mean, like we didn't shower or anything, did we? We just come back and... No, um, well, to be honest, we went out and we've kind of gone to the glass house, we've gone to the crow's yeah, nest. The glass house, we, we, were, we, were, we were really chuffed that Boom Boom, which is the Charles boom Smith boom. wine, was actually included in our drinks package, which we were yeah. buzzing about. And we, we met some lovely people at the crow's nest, and yeah. we met some more people at the... Atrium. And he went to magician. We went, we, magician was fun. Like he was really good. Like actually. So now we're going to go to dinner. So we're tonight's dressed. plan is we're going to dinner. There's nothing else planned. There's no shows or anything planned tonight. So it's we're just going to just going to be a fun. Chill. Night. Although we keep getting lost trying to find our room. Oh, we need a mask. Um, yes. We just, we we keep getting lost. We do because like some of the ships Take closed closed off of the quarantines for the for the COVID for the virus. Yes. We are going out on our, on See our you fun, fun time out. Bye. <laughs> All of the main dining rooms on Pino Iona are anytime dining, which is really convenient and something we love, just turning up whenever we're ready. Still trying to find our way around the ship, we decided to eat at the first dining room we came across, which happened to be the Aqua Restaurant. Oh, this is nice. Lovely, isn't it? We're in like, I don't know what, re what restaurant is this, Aqua? I don't even know. I think it was Aqua. So yeah, we're at the Aqua Restaurant, aren't we? Absolutely. I think it's Aqua, we're going to have some food now. It's like nice in here though, it's lovely. We like it, don't we? Are you Hank Marvin? Oh, well, to be fair, we've not eaten since breakfast. Yeah, I, Which was I like half ten this morning. Bacon sandwich and a half this morning. That's all I had. All I had all day. Oh, his so I'll show you the menu now. You'll see what's on the menu. Let's have a look, shall we? To study this menu in more detail, just pause the video.
what you're going to go for? I'm going for Dutch style um, golden fried chicken croquette. Dutch style golden fried chicken croquette, it's a bit yeah. It's full, but. No, no, and then what are you have then? And then I'm going to go for the six ounce beef sirloin. So, Luke, what are you have? So, I'm going to go for my favourite, which is the Atlantic prawn cocktail, which is that one. Which is that one there. And then I'm going to go for a salmon. We were really impressed with the service at the Aqua restaurant. Our food was delicious and served in a timely manner, with minimal weight in between courses. Our waiter was quick to fill our wine glasses too, given our pace. It looks like you hated it. I absolutely hated mine. I couldn't eat it. <laughs> no, <laughs> I ate, I have all my foods. They were nice. I love my salmon. Was gorgeous. So, what what do you say? Your, what, do you, what are you going to go for? Sticky toffee pudding and probably cheese plate. So Gavin's going for a steam sticky steam sticky toffee pudding. I'm going for a, a steam sticky toffee pudding as well. And uh, we're probably going to go for a cheese board. And we're having a port as well. We have to. We like a port, don't we? We love a port. Are you having port? Yeah. So we're going to have a port, a cheese plate, and a steamed... I'm going to do a sticky toffee A steamed sticky toffee pudding. Enjoy! Cheese. I'm eating my carrot, I am. Cheese and port. Just my celery. You said I like to eat celery, but I don't. I only eat some on a diet. And that's definitely celery. And I have like a date and an apricot in it. So it's a nice little cheese board you got there, huh? Yeah. yeah a little biscuit and all. Oh, it's grapes. Do you have grapes? Yeah. Yep. Yep. And have some port as well. It'd be nice. It'd be lovely that well. Enjoy. Well do. Well, we have had a lovely meal at the Aqua restaurant. It was very nice. Yeah, it's nice. I mean, I have had to put myself up on the sofa using a cushion. Oh, I dropped it. <laughs> Where are the people? The people need to see that, 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 that. I'm sitting. At, I had to sit on the cushion because I'm not the shortest of people. Would you say I'm short? I'm not short, am I? But it feels really low. So I had to sit on a cushion because otherwise I felt like I was down there and he was up there. And I don't want him getting the high ground, do I? No. So now I need to go to Anderson's now for a fun time. But the restaurant's empty behind us, so we're the only people in here. Look. VIP. This is what I find really interesting that they have glued baubles on the wall. Very interesting. Oh, is this and this is Anderson's in here, Gav? This is Anderson's in here. Look at this, people. Oh wow, it looks very relaxed in here. It's like a bar and library. Oh, there's a man in here. So we are now at Anderson's bar. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. <laughs> Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So now we're having a, uh, what is it? A ma ma Marabella gin and wine. And we're enjoying it at Anderson's, which is our, this is the first place we ever came to drink on our first ever cruise on Aurora. We love Anderson's. We love Anderson's Aurora. And now we are here on Iona, which we're kind of glad they've revived it and brought it back to life, but it's not quite the same. I mean, there is a fireplace in it, in fairness. It's a very modern version of it. It's not. I, I prefer the, the traditional yeah. Anderson's. I prefer like the wood panels on the walls and the nice paint. Like, it was like something from Titanic before. Like, it's very nice. Is it very nice? This is my Marabelle gin. <laughs> have, have you actually tried it yet? Yeah. Yeah, tried it. Oh, I'll try it now. I like the gin. Ooh. Ooh, that's an elderflowery. It's like a GT&E. 
Which is what we had in Answers when we first got on a raw Mint. Right. Yeah, with with mint. Yes. GT and E with mint. That's very nice. We like this. We like this a lot. Yeah. Looks in there somewhere. Where is he? <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> so we've just had a few drinks at Anderson's, haven't we? Oh, lovely. It was fun. We have like, met those people. Lo lovely evening. It's been a good time. And now, now we are looking for... Where are we looking for now? More drinks. More Casino drinks. Coffee. Like Casino and maybe Brodie's. Everybody, everybody's going to Brodie's. Oh, look at the baubles on the wall. Why have they stuck balls? That's like glue. It's like hot glue gun stuck balls. There's loads of balls on the walls. Balls on the walls. That's like a new game, isn't it? What's the balls on the walls? Oh, look, there's like a gin distillery in there. And that's where they make the Marabella. Marabella Road. Marabella Road. There's Gavin. He's, he's there. He's going upstairs with the plates on the wall. They have like very big dishes on the wall. They're like my... Like, on them later on. Yeah, pizza on one of those would be lovely, wouldn't it? They're a bit like my Royal Dalton. Which, no, it you all no actually, my Royal Dalton's more smaller. Oh, my small, lovely. Pino are going to really beep. Good job on this one. <laughs> Rex, there's a pip over the expletive. It's not actually quite bad. It's really nice. It's very, very lovely, actually. It's very posh. Very shiny. Oh, is this is this Brody's down here? Yeah, this looks a bit like Brody-ish. Oh, I'm John gasping for a drink. I'm so pissed. Wow, look at this. This is Brody's. This is nice. They're all playing bingo. Not bingo. They're on the gamblers. During the course of the day, we bumped into fellow YouTubers, Instagrammers and general cruisers, which we absolutely loved. It was great meeting new people and having the chat. We spent the later part of the evening, come early morning, nattering and drinking. It was brilliant and the perfect way to kick off our cruise. So now, now we are leaving Brody's, aren't we? We're going to get some snacks out because it's our first night. It's been, we've, been, we've been out all night, it's like so late. These chairs are like quite cosy. And the windows are like low, like really big. Look at all the windows. It's like an airport lounge, it's so big. And this is a glass house, by the way, people. This is the glass house. I love the glass house. The glass house is lovely. It, it, it might look big on the video, when you're actually here, it's quite intimate. The whole space is actually quite nice. I really, really like this. It's absolutely lovely to be here. On our way back to our room, we decided to see if the buffet was still open. Realising it wasn't, we had a quick look around the Skydome pool instead. It's nice and warm, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's lovely. It's nice in here. All of the like food places are closed. Yes, you won't get food now. No. It's room service, I'm afraid. Oh, it's not the buffet open. The buffet is well and truly closed. Oh, that closed at one. It's like look at the time of the people. Can you see on the clock? It's oh, like, oh, it's like a bus three. Oh, is that a lazy spa? No, it's just a buffet. <laughs> I thought it was a lazy spa. I did. Right, it's we're gonna head back. Well, I was enjoying the view. It's a fun time. I need beef sandwich. So, we've just come back to our room. We've had an amazing night. We've like been socialising with like, loads of people. It's been really It's like four o'clock cool. in the morning. It's like four o'clock in the morning. We've just got some Starbucks. <laughs> so, we have like like luxurious beef sandwich in our luxurious cabin, which is amazing. Look at the it's, artwork. It's, 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 not, it's the, not buffet snacks. It's, it's, it's yeah, room service snacks. Because tonight. the buffet's closed. So, now we're just going to eat this, aren't we? And you're going to eat yours. It's good. It's Awesome. See you in the morning. Yeah. Tidy. Mm. We really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, and we'd be really grateful if you kindly consider subscribing to our channel so you can stay up to date with our latest videos. Thanks for watching.